Uh, hello everyone, I'm Clau and I've been a K-pop fan since 2010 and I'm doing these videos just for fun. Sometimes I make grammar mistakes and I have problems express myself. So I don't know how this video is going to end this. So we have in Rise official debut. Uh, and I already reacted to Siren and Memories. That was the, the name, right? Uh, and uh, I still don't know new members, still the same four, I hope. I know for for sure Shotaro and Sung Chan, and then maybe Yun Sung can one be no, I think, and I never and I didn't learn any new members. Uh, can I recognize them? I think so, but their names like that's a totally different story. And also the light is going to go crazy because it's cloudy, so you have sun. Then five seconds later, there's no sun anymore. So. So, let's just jump into it. So, three, two, one, go. If you want something to play with, get a guitar. No one in it can get or make it. Ooh, how the funky. Someone stepping like one, two, five. More the chip chung as you went now, pet a guitar. Cause I know you know, oh, baby, oh. If you want something to play with, get a guitar. Get, 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 get a guitar. I love that that they put this. They weren't that aggressive like with Siren. That makes sense. Everyone, is, why are they so obsessed with the lollipops? <laughs> Using as a skateboard is going to be no. Oh, the funkiness! I love it. I love the funkiness! Okay, okay. Uh, I. Oh, okay. I was super curious how the beat is going to be because Siren we had that very hip hop heavy song and then Memories. It was uh, such a. F I, okay, I'm going to be honest. Memory still is my favorite from what I heard until now from the three songs like memories that song it's I I just love the song so I wondered how the um, the debut is going to sound like and I love that they went to such a funky uh, song they didn't went the heavy hip hop because. Uh, we already have a lot of this type of song, especially from SM. So I love that they went to the oh, to the funky road, and I suppose the mini album has different sides, different sounds. Um, 
and also i really really loved i know there's an introduction film but at this moment when i'm recording which it's i think immediately after it came out it's live and right now it's like it's live like it, it premieres the introduction so um, i'm maybe going to watch that on my own or i'm not going to watch it other like who knows I, I i'm gonna be honest i thought that it's going to be... I don't know why I had that impression that it's, the debut is going to be something like very emo-inspired, music-wise. But they want to more funky route. I don't know why I... But, again, I'm glad they went funky route. Uh, so, I'm going to read the lyrics and then maybe watch again the MV. So, so, but I take the lyric, it's not a specific like telling you to get a guitar, but if you want to do something, just uh, start it. Uh, and maybe in this case, on their case, like get a guitar, it's like them starting to getting prepared for their uh, idol life. Uh, and maybe saying that every time they uh, they get on stage they get that excitement uh, in this case when I play a guitar I really love it uh, just if you want to do something just get the guitar go and play like if you want to do I don't know drawing just get a pencil and a piece of paper and just draw that's how I take it just uh, if you wish to do something, you can start immediately, don't really think about it. That's how I take it. So, three, two, one, play. If you want something to play with, get a guitar. Also, I love whatever they went to that set, having a lot of guitars like uh, as a background. I love that background so much like i don't know how to play any of the instruments uh so i think that it looks aesthetically pleasing having different guitars different colors such an amazing contrast and is he wombie or just i remember the name and i don't know who is the member because it, it can happen and he's Unsok, right? Maybe, like, I don't know. I hope! Him! Do you know who reminds me? Like, his facial features is like someone from first generation, like those idols. I don't know, maybe Kangta from HOT. I, I don't know why <laughs> my, my brain went there. That's such a funny MV. Shotaro. I, I'm the, speaking of Shotaro and seeing his uh, outfit, like the very cropped up with the shirt underneath, like a dressing shirt. Dressing shirt. Uh, is this what it's on? Uh, how would you say it? The new stuff in fashion? I, I, maybe if the crop top was a tiny bit longer, it would look, for me, it would, it would have looked better, but again, also, my fashion, it's almost non-existent, so <laughs> I just say that it would look a tiny bit better if that crop sweater would be a tiny bit longer. I don't know, maybe the movement would look better. 
I want something to play with. Get a guitar. Get a guitar. I have to say, Sung Chan's haircut here is a tiny bit better style. Oh, so they. There was. um. So you see, they are um, trying to sneak on into this theater. Wait. Is this the same famous theater, like for example, where uh, BTS has filmed Black Swan? Is this the same theater, or it's uh, another fancy theater? It just looks like on the MV, it's like we ha want to perform, so let's just sneak into the fanciest theater that there is and make our dreams come true. <laughs> just feeling good, maybe that excitement that being on uh, on stage. Uh, I must say, I wasn't fan of the stage. I was part from on the uh, school, uh, how do you say, choir, choir, and uh, also I ha sometimes I have to say like I don't know some sort of poetry or something like that, and uh, singing like then I what well, didn't have problems because there were more people. But if it was only me, I have to say I don't know some part of poetry. I was like, <laughs> why me? And then in university, they're like, oh, we have some extracurricular activities uh, come and join us to the theater I was like theater me on stage again no So this is uh, the dance break, but it also looks like it's the guitar solo or if it's on a band, you know. Love the funk in it so much. And the footwork. Congrats, Rise on debuting, and especially in my case, congrats, Shotaro and Sungchan at last debuting on having their own team. Uh, like a lot of fans waited almost two years seeing them debut with NCT, but it didn't work out. So we glad just to see them debuting, and also congrats to the other members that made it to this team. So, it, uh, are they having a, pa, 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 a mini album or is it just those three songs? Oh, for now it's say just singles. So, are they debuting with a single or after two months are they coming with like a mini album or is there more? I think this is the debut, right? I really, really, really enjoyed all of the song, 
songs. All of the songs. Uh, but again, my favorite is Memories. Then it's Get a Guitar. And then it's Siren. I can wait to hear more of them. To see if are they going to put content on their YouTube. Like, for example... I, I think the only group that SM is doing more with YouTube, like making uh, variety shows, their variety shows and putting them on YouTube, it's only NCT. I don't know why they don't do the same for the other groups. Like, I know sometimes you have, like, the type of variety show on their... Um, YouTube channel, like, I'm sure sometime you have EXO that's doing, like, a fun video with the members. Um, so I'm wondering if they're going to use the same strategy content-wise with uh, RISE. So I, that's what I'm curious to see if they're going to put other type of content on their YouTube channel. Did I make sense? Did I went in circle? It's totally possible. So I think that's it. Uh, if anyone watched it, thank you, thank you, thank you very much. And bye bye.